tragedy strikes the Columbus Blue Jackets. What happened to Matisse Kivlenix and the tributes being made to him tonight? Local for you, NBC4 at 5 starts now. Tonight, the Columbus Blue Jackets and its community mourning the loss of one of its own. The team announced today 24-year-old goaltender Matisse Kivlenix is dead, and police say his death was the result of a fireworks accident in Michigan. Thank you for joining us for NBC4 at 5. I'm Audrey Hassan. And I'm Jamie Ostroff. We are bringing you team coverage tonight as we learn new details about what happened and the legacy he leaves behind. NBC4's Whitney Harding is sharing some of the tributes being made online as well as those great memories he made with his teammates. First, though, Dan Perlman joins us live from the Arena District. And Dan, this is news that rocked the fifth line and many across the hockey world today. Audrey, it absolutely did. Now, police in Michigan are looking at what happened last night as an extremely tragic accident. That, as you can see right over here, fans are dropping off signs, uh, flowers. They're leaving balloons for the goalie who won the last game of the season here just a couple of months ago at Nationwide Arena. Your heart hurts because uh, the fifth line's a family. We're a big family, and uh, we grieve with everybody when, when we lose a loved one, you know? So it's uh, it's hard. It's hard, hard day for the hockey community here in Columbus. Matt Pfeffer is a longtime Blue Jackets fan who likes so much of the fifth line, heard the news this morning. Matisse Kavlenix was dead. I, I didn't want to believe it at first. The 24-year-old goalie from Latvia was in Michigan. Lieutenant Jason Meyer from the Novi Police Department there telling me the initial investigation shows Kivlenix was in a hot tub at a home when there was a fireworks malfunction, causing some of the fireworks to be shot in the direction of onlookers. Kivlenix collapsed upon exiting the hot tub. Meyer says police initially thought they were investigating a slip and fall with a head injury, but he told me the autopsy shows Kivlenix suffered damage to his heart and lungs due to a firework exploding near him. We believe what happened is the actual explosion itself, the shock of the explosion itself damaged his internal organs. Meyer adding police have no reason to believe foul play was involved or any laws were violated. At this time, we're treating it as a tragic accident. That is members of the fifth line place hockey sticks outside their doors, a tribute to one of their goalies in Columbus. All we can do is just uh, carry on number 80 in our hearts from here on out and just remember that he's looking down on us every time we touch the ice. Now, Kiv Lennox went 2-2-2 two, two, and 2 with the Blue Jackets. He also played in 85 games with the Cleveland Monsters, so his impact was felt throughout this organization.